Souvenir programs, folks. All the competition timetables, all the pro athlete profiles. So we're at day one of the show. The show starts in about 30 minutes. The stand's ready to go. The helpers have arrived. Some guys emailed me about three months ago asking if they can help out for the show. They live in Melbourne, so they've come. I'm telling them what to do and what they need to do each day. Um, we're waiting on a few last bits, so we need the AV set up and power to the speakers, and then we are good to go. Let's get my laptop. Good going, good going. Excited for the first day to use the new teal system. Don't know how busy it's going to be. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. Athlete wise, Paige and Bradley flight delayed by 12 hours, someone had a heart attack on the plane, so they're currently in Hawaii, uh, staying over for a delayed 12 hours. They should have been here 10 o'clock this morning, they're now going to be here at 1 o'clock in the morning the next day, so they come into the hotel, check in, go to sleep like, on their jet lag and they go straight to the expo, so fair play to them, go straight into it, but yeah, that's a bit stressful, but I think it's going to work out just in time, but day one's about to start. Waiting for the athletes to come and get this party on the road. I've never been to an expo before and I'm genuinely kind of astounded at I've never been to a fitness expo in general. And the guys have always told me it's crazy when Jim Shark do an expo. But we're about how long we've been? The doors have been open for about 10 minutes. And the queue for athletes aren't even here yet is absolutely ridiculous. Like, I've never seen anything like this. Shocked and astounded. Hi! You're at the front of the queue. I'm so excited. Why are you here so early? Oh, because I'm Blob Nikki. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I've been a subscriber for years and I'm so excited, so can't wait. <laughs> okay, what's up guys? We are at the Arnold Classic in Melbourne today and we're gonna go meet some people. It's gonna be crazy Nikki getting here. Day one. I'm so excited. It's a sneak it's preview of what's already <laughs> coming. Yeah. It's a sneak preview. <laughs> <laughs> you go again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. I was wide awake half six in the morning editing videos. I'm ready. Bring it on. You ready to meet some people? We're ready. We're ready. Lady? I'm tired. <laughs> I've had three coffees and I'm so tired. Ready to go. I'm ready to meet people. Girls, are you excited to be working with you, Charles? So excited. Very keen. I feel like pumping already. <laughs> Bye, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, <there you> <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Alright, I cash all my money, all my birthday money. I get all the shit. Make sure you don't dip your head, so nice and tall and pop the tricep. And for added emphasis, Tom. They love it, they love it. And this flex is good time. And here's the, the main thing, the main thing while we're here, don't anger the Joe. Is, um, you know, um, be social, friendly. I got nothing out of sleep. Don't anger them. Joey's put specifically on me to My not job. talk for too long. My job is to keep, keep him fast. So he slowly talks for too long. That I, I love talking to everybody. He controls it. He doesn't even talk sense. Let's see how well Joe can do that pose. Yes, one. In. Flex. Flex what? That, that's <laughs> dragon. Flex it. First day in the stock room, aka Pig Pen. 
It's alright at the moment, quiet, it's all gone well so far. Um, but tomorrow is going to be absolutely manic, so just going to just be in practice for today. But well, I can't wait for tomorrow. These hips don't love it. You get free dance lessons when you join Gymshark. Say again? You get free dance lessons when you join Gymshark. What did you learn so when you got your free dance lessons? What did I learn? Yeah. Do you want to see it again? Yeah. That's about it. Nice, man. Yeah, Cam, what did you learn when you got your free dance lessons? <laughs> It. You do realise I've got a camera, yeah? <laughs> I am feeling amazing. I was just saying I was really nervous because this is my first time attending like an Australian expo or just like one out of the country, so I was like, no one's gonna know me! But I've actually met so many people already and I'm so excited. It's been amazing. No crying, no crying. Let's go and see Steve Cuff. Early access. He's meant to come at four o'clock. You guys want to see him now, and I'm going to do it. Follow me. Follow me. Proud dad at the minute because this, this is Cameron, my uh, my member of staff and customer service, and he's actually got a fan from the other side of the world. Incredible! <laughs> Congratulations! Thank you, Parkin. We're going for food. I don't know about these lot, but me. Woo! I'm hungry. Dude, some, there's a girl that came up to me and she was trying to take a photo, and she was trying to take a photo of her friend, and she was she was shaking so much she kept blurring the photo. She was just like so nervous. Like, well, how are you nervous to meet me? I was like, what, take it what, for them. What's nervous about? It? Yeah, selfie. Just no, that's what you gotta do. Yeah. I'm the most awkward person in the world, so why anyone's nervous? I get yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> like if I I'm real I'm, awkward. If I say I'm gonna make, like sometimes they'll be like, oh, I'm a fan of like Bart and Gio. I'm like, oh, like let's make a video for them. And I start off the video. They should be the ones being like, hi, Bart and Gio. I'm like, hey, Bart and Gio. I got some. There's a fan here that wants to take a video. I'm like, God damn it, this is so awkward. So bad. There's just multiple videos of you spiraling around, just looking to bring up on it. <laughs> hey Jazz, what did you eat for dinner? I hate, I hate you cutting. Somehow. <laughs> oh, this is not mine. Mm. No, Nikki was eating oh, this. this is, I think he did mine. Did love it. <laughs> it was so good, wasn't it? My stuff there, no, it was. Uh, I've seen in Australia. I know, they're all fake, but hey. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I wouldn't have known that. You wouldn't? No, I mean, I, I, I hate Kanye West, but I will not be buying a pair of those. Yeah. You get that on tape? I'll That's right, that. Kanye. What? what? <laughs> Sweet ass. Thanks so much, man. Thank you. Absolutely. Man, I don't nae anymore. Nae nae so old. Now I just... Hi! Hey! 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 Oh. <laughs> hey, were you gonna dab? No. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that was worse than stab. No way, I think he went this way with it. Exactly the moment. So he's been having a running clock and he's been waiting. We're at 3 hours, 51 minutes, and stop. 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 There we go. Three hours, 52 minutes even. Worth it. Worth, worth it. No way. Definitely worth it. Man. He's lying to I you. I don't wait for anyone. No? Oh, man.
End of day one, uh, end of day one, had a great day. It's the end of day one, the day's gone really well, oh. I couldn't be happier. It's still a big ass queue for Steve Cook, but we're, we're ready for the next two days. Uh, I've been managing the queues for the athletes, so Lex, Nikki, Jasmine, Lainey. Met some really great people, had a lot of people through. Uh, it was a really good day, really tired, two more days left. Not sure how we're going to cope, but it's been good, we're enjoying it. It's been really, really busy. Really good job, sold a lot of stuff, but I just know how busy it's going to be tomorrow, so tonight we're going to get really well rested and be really ready for tomorrow. It's been absolutely manic, everyone's actually tired, can't wait to go to bed, but today's been a practice and tomorrow's going to be even worse. So, we've plenty of stock, we've had a lot of replan, but tomorrow this is going to be gone. It is the end of day one, the last person, and we are already an hour over the time we should have been here, but there was people waiting, so I stayed. It's been Supposedly the quiet day and there was a queue here that would have lasted seven hours if it hadn't been cut off So tomorrow is gonna be crazy. We're looking forward to it. We can be tired next week <laughs> You turned me lesbian He's just texted me again. This is absolutely fucking insane. Another mechanical issue on the plane. Another? Yeah, the second mechanical issue. They're still in Hawaii. They're still stuck in Hawaii, and they could be up to 12 hours late, which means they're definitely missing Saturday at the expo. So there's one day gone already. We'll can only get to, can only come here on Sunday. We'll have to try and get a different flight because if they keep waiting for their flight, they'll never get here. So we we'll have to do to meet anything different, whatever we can. We'll try and book another flight. But otherwise, it's what I'm going to say to everyone: they've been announced already. They're coming. Just a quick update on the athlete situation. Paige, Hathaway, and Brandon Martin are currently stuck in Hawaii. Someone had a heart attack on the plane, which made them do an emergency land in Hawaii. Everything was resolved. They got on a new plane. That's had mechanical like problems and stuff. They've now been delayed for like 12, 13 hours. So they've definitely missed Saturday at the expo. And we're trying to make some plans and rearrangements to get them at the stand on Sunday. But we can see what we're going to do. Not looking good at the moment, but. I'm gonna do the best I can to rearrange some stuff, but it's a bit of a joke at the moment. So unlucky that it has to happen now, but hey, what can you do?